address will be given by Adelina Jasmine
Go confidently in the direction of your dreams. Live the life you imagine by Henry David Thoreau. I don't have games to prove my point, but I do have a message. So when I read this quote, I think of two words, success and discernment. What does success mean to you? For a person who views success as an intellectual gift, their success may show through their grades and what they got on a test or assignment. Success could also mean you have successfully participated in class or won a debate contest. Many other people view success as making a lot of money, having a good job, a nice house, or a nice car, excelling in sports, excelling in school, and excelling in life. There are honestly countless definitions of success, but how you define it is what really matters. You are the captain of your own boat. I personally believe that success should not be a destination which you have succeeded in life just because you have made a lot of money or have a nice car. Success should be a journey. My personal definition of success is being happy in life. I believe that no amount of wealth or luxury is valuable when you are not happy with your life. A high paying job does not give you happiness if you do not enjoy it. Throughout your journey, throughout your journey through life, being surrounded by those who make you happy, friends and family, and enjoying your chosen career path is how I can find success. Which leads to my second point, sermon. The sermon is a process in which we question what we want for our lives. Just like what my philosophy professor here at Siong said on the first day of class, in this course, when I quote, in this course, I will make you question life itself so that you may be truly enlightened. But honestly, during, during that class, the only thing in my head was, what kind of class did I just get myself into? I believe some of us know who this particular professor is, since he or she is the only philosophy professor here. The sermon is when we make a critical decision that will determine our future. Similar to our first day here at Siwan, during the registration when they asked us to choose a major. By choosing a major, we chose the path that leads us to becoming who or what we want to be. The process of the sermon is crucial in developing ourselves so that we may be confident, so that we may go confidently in the direction of our dreams and to live the lives we imagine for ourselves. Our speech is short because I was supposed to keep it up to five minutes. So I would like to end things off by thanking our families and all of those who played a role in our success today. To my fellow graduates, today marks a milestone in our journey true success depending on how you define it. There is much more that awaits us down the road. I wish you all the best. Congratulations to you all and good luck on your journey. Thank you. Let's give our valedictorians another big round of applause.